In 2010, Zoe Bookbinder, that's me, visited New Folsom Prison for the first time. What I thought would be one interesting day turned into a decade-long collaborative project. I visited the prison often over the next five years, performing and teaching music workshops, and I started collaborating with writers and musicians who were incarcerated there. And I realized that their stories were as much imprisoned as they were. It's easy to dehumanize people when we don't know their stories. Because I couldn't record inside, I started to think of myself as a recording device. I learned songs that were written inside those walls, and with permission, I took those songs and those stories and those words out with me each time I left the prison. All of this became the seed for the Prison Music Project, and long time gone, the album produced by Zoe and myself. Some of the songs were written entirely by men inside New Folsom. Some are poems that Ani or I set to music, and some are raps that we recorded over the phone. The songs on Long Time Gone are as diverse as the people who wrote them. Since we couldn't record inside, we enlisted a large and diverse group of singers and musicians to record on the album. Most of them are women. Most of them worked for free, as Ani and I did, and the profits from this record will benefit incarcerated and formerly incarcerated communities. And the funds will be administered by the Southern Center for Human Rights. The stories on this album belong to Greg Gatlin, Alex Patrice, Spoon Jackson, Bruce Dixon, Jacob Allen, Nathan Jackson Brown, Abraham Banks, Ken Blackburn, and Samuel Brown. Daddy was a hustler. Mom got high by any means. This album also tells a larger story about incarceration in America. And we hope that by sharing these songs and these stories, we can help build understanding and empathy for those people whose lives have been affected by mass incarceration. Survivalist, I feel like I was meant to go to this. Would I be here without the fear? I could still hear a shit. I wonder what would have happened if this didn't occur. I wonder where would I be at? What am I looking verse? We, the creators of the Prison Music Project, believe that the current criminal justice system is rife with racism and classism. Our mission is to encourage a shift to a justice that is truly just for everyone a justice that centers empathy and healing rather than vengeance and endless punishment. Our goal is to affirm the humanity of the two million people living in cages in America by allowing the world outside to hear some of their stories. Where would I be without my years of age when I hit the penitentiary Thought it was okay, but it was affecting my family Reality, kicking in and so mentally I had to get my shit together Cause I can't be here forever Never will I ever self-destruct Cause I know I'm better I know I've been going through things But it's gotta change And I ain't playing most for a victim But I maintain Easily pushing through the pleasure Gotta push the pain Hardest thing I ever had to deal with was the pride Cause I'm from If they disrespect for your ride And where I'm from That's the only way to survive Pushing and striving my way to stay alive, survivalist. I feel like I was meant.